Hi all. Today we will see how we can actually do imputing of missing values with the help of SPSS. So I will take the example of a data set in SPSS. So in this data set you can see uh, some of the values are missing. Especially in the case of gender you can see a lot of missing values here and in the case of age also you can see some of the values are missing. So this can happen uh, during the time of uh, data entering or uh, sometimes the respondents are not given appropriate answer they are refused to give the answer so the questionnaire was incomplete and when we ended the data to the SPSS we are forced to make it blank so while analyzing this data we can see the missing data in our data set if you go ahead and do the analysis with the help of SPSS you will not get the accurate results because a lot of values will be missing. So in order to avoid this kind of a scenario, we need to give an appropriate value in this missing field. So in statistics, imputation means replacing the missing data with most appropriate value. So the system itself will calculate what is the most appropriate value based on the technique which we are actually using and the system will replace this missing data with substituted values and in statistics this replacing of missing data with substituted values is known as imputing of missing values so in this video we will be using SPSS to see how the SPSS will do this imputing so there are various options available in SPSS to do the imputing the first one is imputation by series mean imputation by the mean of nearby points imputation by the median of nearby points so we will be discussing regarding these three aspects in this video so how to go ahead with this one we will see we will open uh, the SPSS window so here we can see uh, two different variables one is uh, the age and another one is the experience so here in the 9th row we can see there are some values missing in the 10th row we can see some values missing in the age in the 6th row we can see some values missing in the experience so in order to have an idea regarding how many values are missing in our data field just click on analyze descriptive statistics go to frequencies and then uh, click ok so we can see that see here in uh, this one we can see uh, the number of missing values of 40 in the case of age and uh, in the case of experience the number of missing values is 82 so if we go ahead with the analysis we will not be getting the correct picture of what is our data all about so what we need to do is we need to impute these missing fields with appropriate values so SPSS is having a lot of options it will be giving to us to impute the value so in this video we will be discussing three different methods and how to impute the value with the help of uh, different options available in SPSS so in order to impute the value what we need to do is click on transform then uh, replace missing values just click on this one then uh, select age so in this uh, right hand side you can see which are the different methods available to us so here you can see series mean mean of nearby points median of nearby points so these are the three options usually will be used for imputing the missing values in SPSS so uh, majority of the time the people will be using imputing uh, with the help of series mean so the mean of the entire uh, variable will be calculated and then the missing values will be replaced by that particular series mean so we'll take age to the new variable uh, column and then experience also we can do it all together then what we need to do is uh, check whether it is series mean or you can even use mean of nearby points or median of nearby points so i will be selecting series mean the technique will be same for the mean for nearby points and the median for nearby points so for in this video I will be selecting the series me then what we need to do is click OK so once we click OK the system itself will be replacing the missing values with uh, the 
mean of that particular variable. So in the output window, we can see here age, number of replaced missing values is 40 in the case of age and number of replaced missing values in uh, the experience is 82. Now go to the uh, data view. Here you can see two more, two different uh, new variables is being added here. One is age and another one is experience. So we can even reduce this uh, 20.0 or the decimal points to zero. What we need to do is just go to the variable view and uh, click here. So the values need selected to zero. Go back to decimal view. You can see that the decimals has gone. So the ninth row and the tenth row, we can see some of the values are missing in the actual data set. So in uh, the new data set, the values has been replaced. The actual mean of this particular data set is 22, so it is replaced with the missing values with 22. And in this case of experience, the mean value is 3, so this missing value is replaced by 3. So this is the way in which you need to impute the value with the help of SPSS if you are using series mean. What you need to do is just click on transform, uh, replace missing values, then uh, select the variable which you need to impute and uh, choose the appropriate option either series mean, mean of nearby points, median of nearby points and click OK. We can impute.